Hello, everyone. How is everything? During the COVID, lots of people buy electric bike,、uh, but after three, four years,、uh, battery stop charging, and the most worst thing is、uh, battery manufacturing is out of business. Now, how do we buy the third-party battery to replace、uh, our old one? Today, I will show you how. Check it out. This is a third-party battery I ordered from Amazon. The vendor is called Hellong. And it's a 36 volt、uh, battery with a 10,000 mAh per hour, so it's slightly larger than the original one. And it has a power adapter with this one, and it has a one charging cable、uh, for battery and also one output uh, uh, for the bike. So you. Compare with the size、uh, for the original one and also this new one. And for the new one, it has a LED light. When you press it, you will see how many battery left. And right now, it's out of battery, and we need to charge it now. Okay, then this is my old Genry Genry bike. So everything's fine except the battery.、Uh, I haven't charged it for a while, so it's. It, right now, it stopped charging. So all we have to do is like、uh, we remove the battery and try to change a new one. So we can still buy a new、uh, Gen Z Gen Z、uh, style battery, but uh, this uh, manufacturing is already out of business. So、uh, you probably won't get it uh, uh, online. So let's try our new battery. See how it can fit into our bike. As you can see, the size is slightly bigger than, like, wider than its frame. But、uh, at least it can fit into this gap, and、uh, then somehow we can try to、uh, fix it、uh, after we we hook up all the wires. Yeah. So let's、uh, put it on the side. So after you remove the battery, you will see this one is a mechanical latch for the for the lock of the battery. And、uh, on this side, because uh, my uh, bike is already broken, and、uh, so it won't. Supposedly, you will see four pins, and there are two screws here, one and two. You unscrew these two, and、uh, on the back side, here, there are also two screws, and unscrew these two, and you just slide it out this plastic box. You will see all these wires, and I do have a connector which is loose. So when I when I like uh, move, move, remove this part, this connector is not、uh, connected well. I just plug it back, so nothing fancy. Oh, I already checked the、uh, the battery wire, uh, the power pin with the、uh, external power supply before. So I it everything is working. So you will see this four pin. Originally it looked like this one, and uh, it's. Uh, it's、uh, inserted from this、uh, gap, and、uh, after I put、uh, like、uh, pull it out, and、um, this、um, black plastic was broken, and it just peeled apart. And I checked the、uh, the wires, and the、uh, two wires are red color, which are connected. I check it、uh, with multimeter, and this black two black color actually is connected. So when you try to、uh, hook up with your external battery, you just use one flat. It, it will be good enough. So we need to.、Uh, so since it's already broken, so I can just use these two. It has more flexibility to hook up with the wires. And、uh, for these two, I just use a black tab to make sure it won't show it、uh, to each other. That's it. So this tab is、uh, waterproof, and I just bought it、uh, online, and.、Uh, Just use、uh, the one piece of、uh, tab to wrap around with this、uh, electro metal. Keep something like this one. Make sure you won't、uh, accidentally show it and causing the the fire. It will be the least thing you want you want to see. Yeah, I remove this uh, uh, black tab. After I remove it,、uh, you can see this wire is soldered on this、uh, plate. So I just cut it out. Since I it's too big for me, 
and I just I need to remove this uh, red plastic part to expose this uh, metal core inside. Now we are trying to uh, connect the, the wires into the battery and try to be careful not touch uh, positive and negative wire together otherwise you will see a spark like this. It's very dangerous. It's very dangerous. Dangerous. So make sure you don't make the same mistake as I do. And this battery also provides the adapter of the XT60. And I realized this one might be better in terms of uh, hookup with uh, uh, both uh, positive and negative wire without shorting each other. After we hook out the wires, we just uh, put uh, these box back and uh, screw the two screw back. And then the uh, final, after I place this uh, battery like this way, and then I can charge my battery with this uh, power adapter. And also I can check the battery value here. The last step is uh, to fix this battery with a battery frame. So I got this uh, plastic strip and one single one is a little bit short so instead of using one I just uh, connect, uh, connect the three of them and then we can test the system we can power it on Okay, there you go. The battery is on and it has a function still it can work. So nice. And then we test a throttle. Nice, it's working. Cool. then we power it off, everything is fine. Okay, that's how we fix this one. And this is my topic today. If you like my video, um, please subscribe and like it. And let me know what you think in the comment. And I will see you next time. Bye.